you won't be able to turn back, Koopo. <sighs> I should go with you, Koopo. I can fight too, you know. Of course you can. But Mog, I need you to do something much more important. I need you to stay here. I want you to be our lighthouse. Koopo? <laughs> Sarah will need some sort of beacon to help her find her way back here, right? That'll be you. And when you see her, don't forget that smile. Leave it to me! Benevelza, god of light. What is a human strength when measured against your power? It would be madness to fight you. But I am more than a human now, because I have been remade by gods. I will lead the dead and drag you down into the chaos. You're finished. He had a dream of eternity. It was always his desire that this world would last forever. He battled against all the forces that would bring about its end. But his dream was shattered. The world faced its death, and he couldn't stop it. Goddess Etra was destroyed, and the nurturing flow of life no longer seeded the world. Entropy advanced. But that's when he saw it. The swirling, invisible forces that breathe life into the universe. That gave form to raw matter. The life force that exists in all of us. The goddess took the souls of the dead and made them be reborn. She breathed life into each new generation. Yes, but when she was destroyed, that cycle was broken. After that... The world was doomed, so God decided to do it over. Right. Build a whole new world. It would be a simple matter for the mighty Bunavelza. He has the power to shape matter and create any material thing. But what's in our hearts and souls has no form. Great though his powers are, he cannot create souls, nor can he mold them. So he needed someone to help. A fisher of souls. A savior who would cast her net into the ocean of life. And gather those who were worthy of being born in the new world. She was God's servant. But not just that. God has big plans for me, doesn't he? Being the savior was just the first step. If I could complete my task in the short time I had, then he would know that I could carry out the real mission and replace the lost goddess. <laughs> Etro is gone, and she will never return. The new world needs a new goddess, one who can restore the cycle of death and rebirth. You must become the ruler of chaos, the goddess who takes the souls of the dead and places them in the hearts of the newly born. <laughs> I'll become a goddess of death, all right. But not the one you want. I'll be the goddess who kills you! <laughs>
behold, the grandeur of a new world born before your very eyes. Millions of human souls yearning for life, ready to be reborn. And yet, the moment of renewed life recedes. My glorious new world must be destroyed. After you went to all that trouble. It is your doing. You stopped the Sacred One from singing the Soul Song. The souls are poisoned, prisoners of their past and of their fates. What God has created, He can destroy. I shall burn it in an ocean of flame. Then you'll do it all over. Rebuild the world, the sky, even the people. But with no memories or feelings, and no past. The perfect people for my perfect world. Free. Knowing only joy, unfettered by grief and grudges. What you're describing isn't human. There'll be puppets that look like people. Bonavelza, you're a god, but you could never see into our hearts. Yes, your souls are opaque to me, but that is precisely why they must be redone. What value can they have? If your souls are not known to God... that if you really were trying to save humanity, maybe I should help you, instead of fighting you. <clears throat> but I'm sure now! You think you can slay God? The goddess of death can! You've made me strong enough! Yes, Savior. You are to be my new goddess. And so I prepared you with many trials. Show me your new powers. Be your final trial. Great and mighty pulse from far flung reaches come to me. Radiant and shining Lindsay from distant depths come forth to me. Goddess to be born, bow thy head and open your heart to the benediction of God's light. Drink in the light and cleanse your soul. Surrender to the radiance. To thy love eternal. If I kill the God of Light, I become the Goddess of Death. Times and trial awaits. Prove your worth as a goddess. Drown in chaos! No teeters!
Your sword against God himself. You shall burn in his life.